What you doing, honey? I'm getting pots ready for our papaya. Ooh. And I also got some pots ready over there for the uh, beauty berries. Yeah. And what else are we going to be doing today? Cassava. I know. We're excited about the cassava. Yeah. I can't wait to have cassava fries again. I know. You love the cassava Oh, fries. my God. I've waited a whole year for this. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys here are the seeds from the beauty berries that we um found collected. yeah collected well we found these out in the woods when we released the raccoon and so i'm going to go ahead they're all dried out i did not because they're so tiny i didn't worry about trying to get them out of the shell so i'm going to go ahead and put at least three to four in each one of these because they're so small and we want a high germination rate. And I'm just lightly covering them. You look like you're flipping me off. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> you have issues, I swear you have issues. Yeah, I'm just gonna put a bunch. I got so many of them. All righty, why she's doing that, I'm filling pots. Yep. Here we are, we got, uh, we got eight of the beauty berries planted and about 50 of the papayas. And we'll see if they germinate. All right, guys. Uh, we're going to start cutting this cassava down and harvest the roots. So we're going to start off by cutting these smaller branches up on top. And I'll lay them down right here and just snap off all the leaves. And we're going to let that just drop right here as a chop and drop. Actually, where are those smaller clippers at? Right here. Let's do that. I'm gonna make it neater. And then I'm gonna cut these off. And I will come down and I'll cut lengths about like this between each node. All right, to do it, right, do it again. I'm going to cut them right over top of the basket there. So they look like sticks. Okay, do wait. So you're cutting, is there a certain amount of nodes you cut? I'm just, well this one here nodes doesn't start to right there. Okay. So I'm cutting. Stop. Yeah. So I can show them. I'm cutting three or four nodes. And then, so one. Yeah, I want a couple nodes underground. Right. And then at least two nodes above, above. ground. So about five nodes. Stop. That one's going to be more, but. All right. So now you're doing a really big one, huh? Mm-hmm. Now you're doing the same five nodes? Yep, about five nodes. 
if there's a few extra, it's not a big deal. Ooh, sun's coming up. Who needs clippers when you got Amy? As fast as you can uh, snap green beans, I should have known she would be good at this too. <laughs> so we're getting down to nitty, nitty gritty. Time to use the big boys. That's gonna be a lot of cassava for us. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Maybe you should. I was gonna say maybe you should trim it every five nodes. That way you can already get them in sticks. I'm gonna get you to hold it. All right, leave that trunk. We'll, let's take care yeah. of these. Cause we'll, I can untie the uh, the straps. Here, I can probably do this. Okay, let's uh. Let's do this one and a half. Woo wee! Now we're gonna see about getting the cassava root up. Ooh. Holy cow. You know oh, what? No. Do you want to uh, unhook the hose and rinse it off a little bit? That's a big piece of cassava there. Here, um, let's get the um, hose off off of that because it's got the nozzle okay. spray, so we can. Um... Didn't get as much off of this as I hoped. Yeah. All right, let's rinse it. You want to rinse it off a little bit? There you go. Piece of cassava. I think this is going to be too woody. Oh, bless oh. it, guys. Sorry. I think this is what happens when you plant. This is this was the root, and it didn't do any new for all the. So what's wrong with it? It's all root. It's all woody. Do you want to go get the shovels? Make sure there's nothing down in there. I'll dig in there and see, but I don't think there's going to be. But I'll cut that off with my saws off, maybe, and plant. It. That might be just too big to plant. I, I would think that's huge. Yeah. Here, grab this one out. This one right there. That's all wood. There's no fleshy material. Sure? Yeah, that's all woody. Is this the same thing? This one here? Let me check that one. Yeah, it's all woody. So no cassava. That's from this one. Well, that was an experiment. Yeah, we did plant it here just to see if it would grow. It grew, just not the way we wanted it. <laughs> Dang it. That's all right. Well, we got enough propagation, so. Yep. Either way, we did benefit. All right. All right, guys. Here's our cassava, cassava cuttings. And I'm going to be planting two cuttings in each one of these pots. And I want to go two nodes deep. So I'll start with this one. This is a, and I'm just going to shove that into the ground like that. And now this is how you know which way, because these all 
already cut the leaves the, the little branches they kind of come down on an angle and then you'll see these little nodules up on the top you know those go up the leaves kind of go down and these little nodules are up so that's how you know which way is which with these and i'm just going to shove them into the soil like that we got some smaller ones here too and you can see the little nodules just going to shove those down same thing right here and put them into the ground here's our cuttings here's the nodes and then you can see the little nodules where a new leaf or roots will come out you want those pointing up you can see them just like that and i'm just going to put it right into the ground shove it in and it'll go over there with those that's how easy it is now when you put these into the ground all you got to do is make a little hole in the ground shove them in and tamp it around them now you used a shovel last time right you you yeah, uh, I just made a little slot in the ground I'll show you when I plant some more we'll do uh, uh no. later on later on I'll uh, plant some more of these right into the ground all right since we got a whole basket and a bunch of pots to fill we'll get back with you guys we'll show you everything after we get done All right, we're here at the second one. We're gonna see if we can find anything out of this. Yeah. Some small ones. Is it too woody? These might be a little too small. all woody so this one didn't produce either I think because it was a root to start with it just stayed a root yeah well there's a small one in there do you want to Pull the weeds no, we out. doing too good with this cassava so, so far this year. Well, if you want to, we can uh, repropagate it using, instead of uh, using the roots like we did last year, just put a couple of branches in there and see how it does. Yeah. Well... Maybe the ones in the back got better. I mean, we got a big one out of this one last year. Yeah. Well, we'll replant. All right, cassava number three. Let's try this. Nothing? It started. Maybe we need to let them go a little longer. Well, all of these... Anything? I say we let these go longer then. Let them go longer? All right. I'm starting to hear thunder. We got another storm coming. You need to make sure all those roots are back in there. In that hole. Where's the cutters? over at by the TV or by the TV listen to me uh, back where we're, the pots are all at what do you think and just propagate this one yeah 
I mean, because that's it started on there. We're just out of luck. Damn, we're so wanting some cassava pies. Darn it. Hey guys, if you like that video, hit that like button, remember that bell, and subscribe. And if you want to see any of the other videos, check out everything over here.